the morning of May 5th, our plant was steady state. We're providing power to the grid, to all of our customers. And then we had a fire. We had an immediate evacuation of the plant, immediate shutdown of the entire plant. Nobody was hurt. Emergency response came in and the uh, fire department came down and got that fire out. The Drake power plant has three units. Drake 7, 131 megawatts. Drake 6, 77 megawatts. Drake 5, 46 megawatts. The fire occurred in a location primarily around Drake 5, Unit 5, but there's evidence of damage to uh, other systems that support Drake 6 and 7. And right now, Unit 5 is sealed off and that's where a lot of the mitigation and cleanup efforts are occurring. During that first 30 minutes, half hour, we lost power in several parts of the, the city. We had 22,000 people lost lost power. And within 30 minutes, we were able to restore that power. That kind of success, very fast, only comes with lots of planning. And that training is multifaceted. We have online training, we have site training, we got uh, tailgate meetings that occur that uh, here's the evolution to happen that day. We have so many activities occurring in parallel. Assessments, mobilization of contractors, uh, review of systems, it includes alarm systems, uh, evacuation systems, fire protection, et cetera, within the plant. We want to make sure our people are safe. We want to make sure our units are reliable. We say safety first, and we, we mean it. And so we're monitoring for contaminants. We have samples that get taken on horizontal surfaces and debris piles, on, and we have monitors that are on people that they wear. This is a personal pump. <laughs> they uh, sample the air where I'm breathing for an eight-hour shift. We have an emergency crisis team whose main focus is to get us out of emergency mode as quick as possible. And they are stepping up to this challenge, working the extra hours, pre-planning, and our plant staff here, proactive, enthusiastic, can-do spirit, mapping out efficiently how to get this plant back up online. Drake 6 first, Drake 7 next. After Drake 6 and 7, it'll be about 75% plus of our, our production from this plant. The biggest reason why we are so focused on getting this plant back up, it's because of our customer. They have an expectation that power will be delivered to them. We are in the business of making power, economically, reliably, available power. One of the lowest cost providers of electricity in the springs is the Drake Power Plant. The summer months are, are coming and we have a peak load in the summertime. Our customers, they're expecting uh, rates to stay low. And so those aspects make it critical for the Drake plant to get back up online. This plant has been so instrumental in providing the electric needs for this city. We're gonna get this plant back on.